I say a very kind f you to all of those people that will click away before I even finish. I am not feeling well today. Tonight? Tonight. I don't know what it is. The flu? A cold? Cancer? Ah! I'm probably dehydrated. Thirsty. You know, they say once you feel thirsty, it's already too late. So I'm gonna die. Goodbye. So if you've ever felt thirsty, and I'm sure you have, haha, -ha, you've had a near-death experience. Several times. We all deserve a medal or something. Did you almost fall off a skyscraper? No, but I forgot to grab a water during my lunch break. Jesus! I know, right? But those emails needed to be sent. No thanks are necessary. Just your undying denial will suffice. Now, I have a message that I want to share with all of you. I got this on Tumblr and it, sorry, it reads, You shouldn't be allowed to post videos. Your face makes me sick. You'll never be pop. <laughs> never be pop. Never be pop. This made me LOL. Because I feel like this person does not know that anybody can post anything. Like, you're allowed to do that. They could post a video if they wanted to. There is a ton of crap on YouTube and I am among that crap. Also, my face makes me sick as well, which is why I always wear sunglasses, just in case I see myself in a reflection of something and the image is too distorted so I won't throw up. And I am sure that you are the most captivating beauty to ever walk the earth. So beautiful, in fact, that if anybody were to look upon you, they would die. They would look at you and their hearts would just explode. So now you have no choice but to stay at home and judge ugly pieces of shit on the internet. And that makes me sad because what a waste of perfection. And finally, I'll never be popular? Uh, I know. If you are on the internet, you have seen or have had internet hate. Doesn't it make you wonder when someone writes you like that? Like I've said in another video before, it's like, wow, you, uh, if only you had better things to do. This bitch didn't. She can't even leave her house without killing somebody. And as I've said before, if haters had lives and things to do, like the rest of us, I don't know, this bitch probably cleans her house, then they work harder than any of us could in 50 years. So much time and thought goes into some of this stuff. Sometimes they resend the same message over and over and over to make sure that you get the message. Hear what I have to say. Random person that will never be a part of my existence ever again. What the hell? I have no life and I don't have time to leave a bitchy comment on something I don't like. I don't like Donald Trump. I think he's a dumb piece of sh I always have. Am I going to tweet him that? No, because I'm too busy doing this sh Plus, I kind of just said it. I do try to make a conscious effort to stay away from stupidity. And how do you do that? You order your groceries online and you stay at home. This isn't tea. Oh, f I almost forgot to tell you. My hot water dispenser broke. So I can't have instant hot tea anymore. I cried in random episodes that lasted anywhere between four hours and several days. This is important information about send crickets that you all need to know. Because a broken heart is a big waste of time. And that's what my channel is for. I have to go, I'm gonna start crying. If you liked or hated this video, the buttons to show that to me are down there always have been. They've always been there. That is the only reason they are there. Subscribe to this piece of shit if you like to waste some time. I post new useless things every Wednesday and Friday. And here it comes. Goodbye, my pets.